And for the top international headlines, we connect now to Stephen Tre at the News Center. FIFA, the world governing body for soccer, is under fire yet again for corruption allegations related to the 2018 and 2022 World Cup bids. And in Zurich, Swiss authorities raided FIFA headquarters and arrested seven senior officials accused of accepting over 100 million U.S. dollars in bribes. Uh, Stephen, how is the situation unfolding? Well, Swiss plainclothes police officers escorted the suspects from a five-star hotel in Zurich. They also raided the organization's headquarters where they, where they seized documents and files related to the case. FIFA Vice Presidents Jeffrey Webb and Eugenio Figueredo were among those arrested. The arrests were made on behalf of the U.S. Justice Department and based on an FBI investigation that's been running for more than three years. Early Wednesday morning in New York, the department charged 14 defendants, including the officials arrested in Zurich, with racketeering, wire fraud, and money laundering conspiracies. U.S. officials told Reuters that the nine officials and five sports media promotions executives face extra tradition to the U.S. Separately, Swiss prosecutors launched a criminal investigation over money mismanagement and laundering for the 2018 and 2022 World Cup bids won by Russia and Qatar, respectively. A FIFA spokesperson said in a press conference that the organization is the victim and they are fully cooperating with the authorities. The bombshell comes just three days before the FIFA Congress meets on Friday to elect its next president. Incumbent Sepp Blatter, who's not facing any charges, is up against Jordanian Prince Ali bin al-Hussein for the presidency.